Hey guys, it's the Digital Tutor here with another step-by-step -step tutorial. And in today's video, we're just gonna take a quick look at how to reset your computer or laptop back to factory settings on Windows 10. So what you need to do is come down here to the search box. And first you need to go ahead and type settings and then click on the settings app. Okay, so on here, you need to go to update and security this box here and once you've clicked that if you look on the left hand side at this menu there should be an option called recovery so if you go ahead and click that and you've now got two options you want to click the top option here which says reset this PC so you're just going to click the box here get started You've got two options now guys, what you can do is select the first option which says to keep my files. Basically what this does is it removes all the apps and settings. So any games you've installed, any apps you've installed and any settings you've changed, they will be deleted, everything will go back to you like it was when you first got the PC or laptop. The thing it will keep is your personal files, so if you've created any work documents, any spreadsheets or anything along those lines, that would be still there after the factory reset has been completed. Now the other option you have is remove everything, which is the option I would actually recommend. Obviously if you do have any personal files, what you can do is get an external hard drive and just copy everything important on your laptop onto the external hard drive before you run this process. Because once you run this process, it will literally delete everything off the hard drive and take it back to factory reset condition. So once you've chosen which option, you need to go and click so in this example, I've just clicked on the keep my files just to, I'm not actually going to reset my PC today, but this is just giving you an idea of what happens. So what, ha what is actually happening now is the laptop is just get everything ready. I'm just turning the laptop, this is what I want to do. Um, and the laptop's just basically packing its bags and you know getting ready to throw out the trash. So. Ideally, you want to use this if your computer is starting to slow down and you've tried to uh, free up some space and you're still having problems. Also, you might be unfortunate in that you've managed to get a virus or you know, you've downloaded some kind of software and that's really slowed down your computer and after you've taken it off, it's still you're still having issues. So if you are having serious issues, then this is recommended. Okay, so what's happened, I've just had a quick message come through now to say ready to reset this PC. Uh, a quick summary of what will happen when I reset my PC. And there's actually a link there which you can click and it will actually bring up a list of all the apps that it's going to take off your PC. And I mean, you'll be surprised actually probably at the amount of apps you have installed. So. If you're all happy to go ahead, then what you need to do is just go down here and click the reset button. Obviously, I'm not going to be doing that today. But yes, if you go ahead, click the reset button and that will start the process. Now, the process can take a while, but it depends really on how much you have on your computer. So if you have a lot of apps installed, it's going to take a lot longer. Whereas, say, if you only had a couple of apps, it's not going to take as long. So I hope this video helped and if you did find that helpful, please drop a like on the video. Don't forget to leave a comment below and subscribe to the channel for more awesome tutorials.